Hey, Shogi fans. Now we're gonna take a look at the uh, three nightmate. It's problem number 66 of Shogi Mio 1, and it's also made in 31 moves. And what I mean by three knights is these two knights here, and yes, the one on the stand. Alright, now the first move is a pawn push sacrifice to 1f, and king takes. And the next move, the third move, is extremely brilliant. Can you find that? Well, it's a gold sack to 2f. Brilliant. Now, if the king takes it, you go dragon to 1g, and king takes the pawn, and dragon to 3g, king 4e, and checkmate. So, when you have made the gold sack, king side will take it with the lance. And now you can move the dragon to 1g. Right, actually, this gold was just blocking this dragon. So the gold was in the way of the dragon, so you just wanted to remove that from the board. Alright, now the king will fall back to 2e, and now the knights start moving. It's knight to 3g. The king can only go into 3f, and this is where you drop the knight, knight drop to 4h, and will you see the only square the king can go to is 3e. Now what is the next move? Yeah, I know, you wanna go the knight to 4g, right? However, watch out! The horse, so you can't move the knight to 4g. So you gotta find a good move here, instead of the knight to 4g. You see it? Well, it's another brilliant sacrifice. Yeah, it's dragon sack to 1e. Awesome! Now the horse will take it, but now the horse lost control of this square. So right, now you can play knight to 4g, and king to 4d. And now you see, you form a powerful wall here, by these two knights. See? So, right, now you can move another knight to 5f. The king is cut off by this wall, so he can only go to 3c. And, yes, knight to 4e, king 4c, and of course, you know the next move, knight to 4e, king 5b, and the knight again, knight to 4d, king 5a. Now you can keep moving a knight here, so, find a good sacrifice. Yeah, it's gold to 4a, king takes, and another sacrifice again, lance promotes to 3a. Well, if the king goes to 5a, you can go horse takes the pawn, sacrificing the horse, and then pull back the promoted lance to 3b. Yeah, these squares are covered by the knights, so the king can only go to 5a, and knight to 4c, unpromote, and checkmate. The way the knights sit in line is pretty cool. So, uh, at this position, when you made a land sacrifice, the king will take it. Now can you find a good move here? Well, it's then knight to 4c, unpromote. And right, the king side can't take it with a pawn because of this horse. So the king will have to go to 4a. Now find the final excellent sacrifice. I'll give you some time for this. You see it? Well, it's horse to 6c. He can't block it. So the silver will take the horse. And now the silver no longer has control on this square. And these four squares are covered by these two knights, right? So yes, it's knight to 5c, unpromote, and checkmate. It's a marvelous three nightmate. Alright, thanks for watching. See you next time.